is Steve and I work for a council in the north of England where I'm a member of the Christian Workplace Group. We've been encouraged by the support we've received from senior managers as we've prayed for them. In 2015, we prepared a business case setting out how we felt we could benefit the council and the kind of support we would welcome from them. We discussed this with our personnel manager on his own admission, not a man of particular faith, but he couldn't have been more supportive in helping us set up a group. We meet with him regularly and about 18 months ago we were discussing how to promote the Christian faith among staff, one of the objectives of our group. We didn't think we could communicate effectively by simply setting out a stall in the office for you, but he challenged us. Why don't you prepare a display to celebrate one of your Christian festivals, like Christmas or Easter? With that challenge, we did prepare imaginative displays before both Easter and Christmas last year, visible to all staff in the foyer of the Council's main office building. Last year, a new chief executive started and a couple of us from the group met up and said that we prayed for him and the senior leadership team. He was very appreciative and in his weekly blog to all staff, he said he felt humbled that the Christian Workplace Group prayed for him, senior managers and staff. We asked him if there's anything specific we could pray for and he identified one service area that was facing a particular challenge and so as a group we've continued to pray for that. So in these various ways we're thrilled that we've seen God at work as we've prayed for our senior managers. And I would encourage you to pray for the senior managers where you work or if you're part of a Christian workplace group, why don't you approach a senior manager or the chief executive and ask if there's anything specific that you could pray for, for your organisation. My advice, go for it. You've nothing to lose.